How's it going, everyone? You alright? I am absolutely fucking busted today. Honestly, I've um, from I, the last three days of training have caught up to me today, and um, to be fair, couldn't have come at a better time because it's my rest day today. But um, yeah, I'm absolutely, I'm absolutely fucking busted. But um, last week, someone asked me about how I managed to train whilst being at work. Um, so basically. What I do for work, it's class as security, but it's not really security. You don't actually need a security badge to do it. We, it's called um, waking watch. Now, basically, I'm in a, I'm in an apartment in a block of flats. It's basically our office, as we call it. It's a two bedroom apartment, um, and this building has so basically the the same materials that ha the, the Grenfell Towers had. And every single building in the UK that have those same materials inside the building basically have to be taken out. So they've put people like me in all of these buildings, basically just to patrol around the building. Um, we have tags on every floor and we have to scan them so they can see that we're doing our patrols. Um, and we're basically there just in case of a fire. Um, and we have to just make sure we, we check the bin chutes and and make sure people ain't leaving rubbish bags in the hallways and and bits and pieces like that and uh obviously we and we're there to to call the the fire brigade and stuff like that we're basically there to to try and stop a fire or identify identify the fire early enough so the fire brigade can get out of here quick and deal with the problem so how my shift works is a 12 hour shift i work 8 till 8 and basically, I have to do a patrol. So I get I get to work. I get to work at eight o'clock. My first patrol, I do it at half eight. And each patrol takes around about thirty minutes if there's nothing really going on. If there's nothing to report or there's no rubbish clogged up anywhere or anything like that. Um, sometimes it can take longer. But once we're done, we then come back up to our office slash flat, whatever you want to call it, and we've. I said we've got a kitchen, toilet, bathroom, TV. I've got my Xbox in here as well. Um, and we've turned the spare room into a gym. And I have an hour and a half between each patrol. So I'll do six patrols a day because we have to patrol two buildings. There's, there's this one in the building next door. So, <clears throat> yeah, so that's, that's basically what I do for a job. But we have an hour and a half gap in between each patrol. So... I thought I'll use that time up um, to the best way I can, really. Instead of sitting around doing nothing, I thought I'd get, get a little workout in on the um, on the weights and stuff like that. And the building's quite tall. It's got 15 floors. Um, it's a very, very big building. So the stairwell is a brilliant thing for cardio. Get some stair sprints in. Try and get all the way up to the top, which, I've, to be fair, I've not been able to do yet. I've done I've done the stair sprints a few times and I can't make the top yet. It's fucking it's, it is a big building and that is hard. That is hard graft. But yeah, so that's basically how I can train whilst I'm at work. Um and now also I do a session Friday night after work as well at nine o'clock at night. So I'm out of the day, I'm out of my house fourteen hours a day. It takes an hour to get to where to where my work is from my house. So I'm up up at up at six, half six. I'm out of the house by seven. I'm at work by eight, and then I'm not home again till nine o'clock at night. And then if I've got to go to the gym, I'm not home till ten o'clock at night. So, um, so yeah. So that's that's how that's how I can work. Uh, that's how I can train. Sorry, whilst I'm at work. So I thought I'd uh, put do this little video for everyone who, who was wondering how I do it. And that's how it's done. But yeah. Anyway. I hope you're all good and I'll speak to you all very soon.